All right, so this is how you change a screen on a Game Boy Advance. So first things first, before you order a screen, you need to check what version you have. And to do that, you have to open the Game Boy Advance. I know that there is a like a method with checking those numbers, but with this, you know for certain. So you remove the seven screws on the back. Some are trial wing. These six are trial wing, and this is just a normal plus, I think it's called. Take off the back, and here I can see that I have the less pin version, and I do not have a screen for that yet. I'll have to order that. So what I'll do for now is take out all of those protectors, and then I'm going to take out the motherboard and take out the old screen. Boom, just lift the motherboard out, put this back in, and to take the screen out, I'm going to twist the shell slightly, but don't do it too much or you might break the shell because it's old, and then you can just lift up the screen with the adhesive. And boom, that's out. So, I'll now check if I have a screen, this screen, and yeah, because as you can see, it's defective. So I'll go check my parts pile and see if I have the same screen just working. Boom, got it. So, now I'm going to take the adhesive and put it back in. Make sure that it's in correctly. Oh, it's here. Yeah, this is probably like the hardest part of the entire thing and it's not even hard boom boom just make sure it doesn't stick out on where the screen is supposed to be because that would be a little ugly boom blow out the dust blow on the screen so there's no dust between the lens and the screen Gonna lift this up and boom, the screen is in. There we go. Now let's see. Looks good. Yeah, I need to need to replace the lens. Or can that just be cleaned away? Not sure. Yeah, and then I'll actually also clean the motherboard since I have the chance. So I'll just clean this contact with some ice purple alcohol. Uh, you can do that if you wanted to. Just so you have better contact and I'll also clean the power switch because those go bad really easily. So uh, yeah, I'll be right back. All right, so I just cleaned up the motherboard. Now I just have to put it back in. And first of all, check that the speaker is in correctly and all the way and boom, then the motherboard will get in. You just have to make sure that the speaker is in its hole and not just loose, I guess, because then you won't be able to put in the motherboard. Now, put in the screen cable, boom, put in these clips, boom. Now, mount the motherboard with the screws. Mine just had two, but sometimes they have three. So yours might have three screws. There we go, put in these plastic pieces. L and R buttons. Boom. Then the this, the power switch switch, I guess. And then the back cover. Kaboom. Now, 
put in all of the screws. And the last screw. And voila, you're done. So that's how you change the screen on a Game Boy Advance. Thank you for watching. Like, dislike, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.